Hello, welcome to another review. Right, another Pilsner for you. This is Pilsner Raquel. Coming in at 4% ABV, 500ml bottle. Um, I've done a group review of this beer as well. That's the bottle cap, back in March. Um, I'll put the link down below, as well as everyone else who's reviewed this beer individually. Um, so this is out of the Czech Republic. Um, Brewed and bottled by Pil Pilsen, by Pilski. I can't pronounce that word. Shock horror. Um, this is part of uh, Saab Miller. So it's a Miller, not a Miller, but it's, it's a Miller brand. Um, so yeah, the original Pilsen, a 500ml bottle. It's in a brown bottle, which is good. Um, bit of smoke on the opening. This beer is actually, I didn't realise it, but it is actually out of date. Oh well, it should be okay. It's been in the fridge since March. So I purchased this in Morrison's in Margate. So I'm not going to get all this beer in this glass until I have a mouthful, but yeah, lovely kind of crisp, clear looking beer clean looking decent carbonation just covering the top of the head with a white it's pat, tightly packed bubbles head <coughs> oh pardon me oh yeah let's see how this is fared i'm doing this on the 23rd of may 23rd 21st of may and this is our best before date of the 3rd of may 2017 Biscuity bready malt. Background noise outside. Impossible to, um, unless I get one of them kind of uh, decent mics to cut all that out, then it's just going to have to carry on, I'm afraid. So hopefully, there's no swearing. Not from me anyway, today. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit bready biscuity. Touch of lemon. It's the same kind of thing, run of the mill Pilsnery kind of aroma. Maybe a little bit of spice in there or something. Anyway, let's give it a try. Cheers. A little bit metallic, a little bit. Um, it's got some kind of. I'm trying to put the finger on what this taste is. There's something in there. That, Definitely a, a biscuity-ness to it. What the hell is that taste? It's a little, I'm not, I'm not sure. There, there is a flavour coming off it, but I'm not quite sure about whether it's the malt or whether the beer is just basically past its best. There's, there's almost a, like a slight dryness on the palate I'm picking up now on the back end. It's not skunky at all. Just that there's a little metallic-ness coming through. But there's also like there's some kind of fruit I'm picking up. Can't put my finger on what, what the hell this this actual flavour is. It's okay, it's not it's not a drain pour. Um, it's it's an average run of the mill pilsner for me. Um, it's 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 um, an un, an unfiltered beer. Excuse the background noise. Uh, 
but yeah, it's produced en masse. There's not a lot to say about this beer, other than if you like Pilsners, yeah, you'll probably like it. I like my Pilsners, but I've had better Pilsners, if that makes sense. Um, <clears throat> a bit more kind of pricey Pilsners. Um, so you basically, with what I find with Pilsners, you, you kind of get what you pay for. As I said, I got this in Morrison's. I, I can't remember how much it was a bottle. I think it was like... Um, 150 a bottle or something like that back in March um, it's okay I'm gonna drink it anyway would I buy it again no not 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 really I just thought I'd do a few reviews as this is kind of a follow-up to um, the live review we done on a hangout uh, back in March um, so I just got like two bottles of this two bottles of that a four pack of this there's three beers this is the second one um, so yeah, so it's the second one I've had, as I just said, twice. How would I rate that? I'll give that... I'll give it about four and a half. A four and a half out of ten. Um, it's just not, not for me. Um, so yeah, if you've had this one before, a lot of people like this beer. Um, Pilsner is it Raquel brewed in Pilsen Czech Republic the original Pilsner let us know your thoughts and opinions uh, thanks for watching if you're new to the channel please subscribe that would be really cool and I will see you on the next review cheers